Okay, I'm picking up where I left off with the um, big box of goodies that I won in, video, in uh, Lydia's um, giveaway. Um, she's like Triple Dog Dare You here on YouTube. So these are the spare parts from Paper Studio um, buttons. I don't have any of these. These are really cool. down in this bag of goodies. Look at all these flowers she sent me. Tons of flowers. Look at that. It's just jammed full of all kinds of roses and um, daisies and tiny roses and I um, can't remember what that's called. Oh, calla lilies. Anyway, very pretty, an assortment of colors, too. Thanks, Lydia. Let's see, and this is pretty cool. Look at all these bags she sent me. I don't have any of these tags. These are those new Prima uh, tags that go with those dolls, stamps. I don't have those stamps. I don't think I'm going to invest in those because uh, I may cave in later on down the road, but right now I'm not going to invest in them because I have stamps right now that I've never used that I need to be using, so... These are really awesome long envelopes. This is kind of a pearlescent um, grayish color, really pretty black one. Um, teeny little bags, paper bags, a whole stack of those. I haven't counted them, but there's a lot in there, enough to make a mini album for sure. And then these are the eight pound bags, pretty large. They can make a, a nice little mini. some little coin envelopes uh, another little tiny envelope I don't have any of those that's really cute um, also these little envelopes and this one has a little tag inside it that's right in there I think this is a blank tag yep okay and um, also, um, oh, for books, hmm. gosh, I can't think of what that's called right now. My mind's a blank. You know what it is. It's a library card. Okay, that cute little envelope. These pretty envelopes here. And some sheet music. So those will make a really cool, um, I can use these in a lot of projects. Lots and lots of goodies in that little bag. Lydia just filled this with all sorts of cool things. I think this is, was the background from, yeah, this is her packaging. This is how this was packaged. And then the, um, this embellishment here was on the back. But I took it out of the packaging. It had a really pretty little doily at the top. She had done it up so pretty. Um, but I will definitely use this in another project. I love that black and white polka dot. I even saved all the little baggies. She had everything packaged up in. I'll probably reuse all those too. I try to anyway. And she sent me a bunch of um, punch outs from this polka dot. Um, I want to say material. It's not. It's paper of her little butterflies and this background here. I like that paper too. Um, it looks like linen, very pretty, but she sent me, um, these little butterflies look like um, lace. I don't know if the camera can pick that up or not, really pretty. Um, and this little miniature stretch canvas, Don't I have never uh, purchased any of those, so those, that'll be fun. And she sent me a whole thing of die cuts here. Look at all these die cuts. Wow. Tim Holtz birdcage. I don't have this die. I like that. Um, I do not have this die. The heart die. I really like that. I don't have this die. I have the smaller one of this one, I think. I, th I don't know what that's called. Baroque or something. But she's used her... Uh, Recycle packaging, and I do this too. I just I think that's awesome that we can do that and and um, recycle things from our kitchens and stuff and and turn them into something useful again instead of going into the landfill. I have tons and tons of boxes. Trust me, 
I don't throw anything away. It's terrible. Um, but, you know, maybe I'll get around to it someday. So these are the Tim Holtz bird cages. Love those. And one of the little birdies. There she is. Cute. Okay. Oh, and this one. I think they call this the cabinet card. I do not have this one either. Really like that. So that's cool. All of those will go in minis. Future minis. Um, let's see here. Here's a sweet little. I think this was on her packaging too with the this gift set here. So I kept that. And this is some of that awesome burlap. I don't have this type. I think it's a, this was um, sold in the ribbon department at Hobby Lobby, I'm thinking. Um, and I don't have any like this because it's finished on both edges, so it, it won't um, fray out, I don't think. I do have like sections of burlap, but nothing like this. So this is pretty cool. She tied it with a little piece of ribbon. And then the inside of the box, she had lined with um, pattern papers, the old vintage pattern papers, so I'll use that definitely. And then last but not least is this box. It's one of the balsa wood boxes, and inside here she's um, put a, a real pretty um, clothespin and she's put some of her real pretty seam binding on there that I can either dye or leave like it is. And this gorgeous um, embellishment there and one of the little um, garment pins. I don't have any of those either. I love that rose, isn't that pretty? It's um, like a tissue paper almost, rose. And here's a little tiny cork that I could alter and a real pretty um, sparkly button on a pin and then she's wrapped some real pretty um, looks like crocheted lace around there and that's kind of a, a cream color very pretty here's another um, clothes pin with some more lace on it and a tiny little rose that it looks like she's handmade uh, using the roll technique how pretty that is and it's in a uh, soft yellow gold color very vintagey looking and then she's lined this box with a piece of lace isn't that pretty I don't have this shape of the balsa wood boxes so I was happy to get that I have a couple other ones but they're the square ones so that was really awesome so that's everything that was in the box except for Lydia's um, journal that she made and shared with me and it is so pretty so I'm going to come back and because uh, I'm almost at 10 minutes and so I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna share that journal with you. And I'm hoping I can put it on a 10 minute video as well. Um, so you're gonna to wanna to see that because she really made a cute journal and uh, I'm so happy that I won it. It's really cute, I love it. So anyway, I'm gonna um, stop this now. I'm gonna put everything back in my box and um, so I can go through it again and again and again and uh, pick and choose and use up um, everything I hope in future uh, projects that I hope to share with you here. So thanks for watching and I'll be right back with the journal that Lydia made for me. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.